I have a bunch of Hakurai turnips. I think that's how you pronounce it. These are a Japanese turnip. Counter cooking. No kitchen, no problem. I've never seen these in any stores, but I get them in my farm box. So this is the first year that I subscribe to a local farm CSA, uh, Community Supported Agriculture. So I get a farm share every week. Uh, it gets delivered to my house. And this week I got a really nice bunch of these turnips. They did have greens attached to them, uh, but what I did was I cut off the greens, um, I washed them, I cut them in pieces, and then I froze them. Um, that's what I do when I have excess greens. I freeze them and then I use them in like soups and meals and stuff. But right now I have these turnips and I just tried one for the first time like a few minutes ago and they are so ridiculously good. I had to make a video about them. Now I never heard of these turnips before I subscribed to this farm CSA and I never saw them before. So I'm making this video to let you know about them. So if you do see them somewhere, definitely pick them up and try them because they are so good. Now the way I ate this was raw. I just uh, cleaned it, sliced it, and ate it like you would a potato chip. And they are that good. Like I could literally eat these like potato chips. So here's one that I just cut up. I cut the top off, the bottom off, and I also peeled it, this is the peel. I just very thinly peeled it. And then these are all of the turnip slices, so I'm gonna taste another one. They're juicy, and they're crunchy, and they're slightly sweet, and they have a very mild and neutral flavor. These are perfect for dipping in like your favorite dip, or even putting a spread on these. Like if I was going to eat these with some avocado, I'd spread some avocado on it. Uh, or, you know, if you wanted to eat these with like egg salad or tuna salad or chicken salad or something like that, they make a really nice substitute for like a cracker also. Since they're a turnip, you really expect more of a bitter or pungent flavor. I really expect more like a radish type flavor. They don't have that at all. Like there's no bitterness, there's no pungency. It's just really neutral and just slightly sweet, but really juicy and nicely crunchy. I would think that if you're on a keto diet or a low carb diet, these would be a good substitution for crackers or chips. Personally, I've been on the specific carbohydrate diet, which is not a low carb diet. It's not keto at all. I can eat all the fruits I want, all the vegetables I want. I just can't eat any sugars other than honey and no grains at all and no starches. So for me, I'm really excited uh, to have these Hakurai turnips because I could use these to eat with dips or to put spreads on and that's a really nice option. Or I could just eat them plain like this when I want a crunchy snack. And so that's my review of these Hakurai turnips. I hope this video was helpful for you. If it was, please give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe to this channel if you'd like me to post more videos. Thanks so much for watching. Have a great day. Bye.